Today, we're going to dive into what it means to have a biblical Christian worldview. As followers of Christ, we need to have a baseline understanding of God's purposes for His creation. We find ourselves in the middle of a fallen world with a vast number of ways to interpret all of the good and evil things that we see around us. Having a biblical Christian worldview essentially means that as much as is humanly possible, we develop the ability to see things in the way that God sees them. We align our values with what God values, and in doing so, we begin to respond in every situation with His heart and His mind. So in February of 2011, my wife and I found ourselves sleeping on the floor of this orphanage in a city called Pune, India. But while we were there, one morning I went downstairs and there was this woman, and her name was Brenda Lewis. And she was visiting the orphanage, and so I figured I'd introduce myself. So. I got to know who she was, and it turned out she was a YWAMer in the city of 15 million people. There's just one YWAMer who just happens to walk into the same orphanage that I'm staying in. So I asked Brenda what she was doing here in India, and she told me that for a portion of her year, she comes to this city, Pune, India, and she spends time with the people living on the streets. There are thousands and thousands of people living on the streets in the city. And her goal is to find parents that are HIV positive and convince them to give their children to the orphanage before they die. So on the second day, when we were going back to visit these people, I remember asking Brenda a question. I said, Brenda, how do you, how do you handle this kind of poverty? How do you, wh- where do you get your strength? How do you maintain composure? How do you do this for so long? And she looked at me with this big smile, and she just said, Ryan, all I see is hope. So when I see people living on the streets, a lot of people will look at them and say, oh, that's hopeless. It's too bad for them, you know, I wish someone could do something for them. And Brenda looks at those people and she says, no, I see hope. I see the purposes of God for these people. And I think that is kind of the essence of having a biblical Christian worldview. That we walk into a place and before we let all of our senses kind of get in the way and cloud the the truth of what's around us, we're able to see things with God's eyes. So throughout your internship and even throughout your whole life, It's important to remember that no matter what we experience, the overarching theme of God's creation doesn't change. There is always hope and there's always healing with Christ. So let this lesson be a powerful time of reflection and contemplation for you as you consider God's purposes for your gifted mind. 